What's up, guys? It's Jake here again at Charlie's Combat Club here for our sp student spotlight segment for the month of July. Uh, this month we are featuring our student, uh, Miranda Granger, longtime student here at C3. Uh, Miranda, how did you, uh, how long have you been training with us here now? Uh, well, I actually started when I was really young, like two years old. But uh, I got my black belt in Taekwondo here when I was 12. And then after college, I came back probably about a year ago. Nice. So it's definitely been something that you, you haven't just recently started doing. You've definitely been training for a long time. Yeah, it's been a big part of my life. Nice. So you say you started in Taekwondo. Um, how much would you say that background helped you in the transition of getting into kickboxing and MMA? I would say it really helped. I think that uh, it helped with my technique a lot and my patience and uh, a lot more discipline than I think I would have if I didn't have that background experience. Nice. So, obviously the Taekwondo helped you, um, helps you, you know, with the transition of things. Um, talk about some of the, uh, some of the obstacles that you've had to overcome, though, in your training. Uh, some of the harder things that you've had to kind of deal with. Um, some of the harder things is just, I mean, like scheduling and stuff, but I try to come in here as much as I can, uh, just make it into as many classes as I can. Uh, not too many obstacles. I, I think, like, I'm more hard on myself than I need to be sometimes, but that's probably it. Nice. Uh, so, this last month you uh, you participated in your first grappling tournament. You did the first Lockable Subsea Challenge uh, up in Bellingham. Uh, talk about that experience. Uh, you went in there and you uh, managed to have some success in the tournament, so uh, talk about that a little bit. Uh, yeah, me and a girl from this, class, this school uh, actually were doing the 140 and under division. And I won that one, and then we decided to do the super weight with a couple girls who were in the 155 to 170 division, and I ended up winning that one too. But uh, I mean, I couldn't have done it without my teammates and my coaches. And, um, it was really, it was a really good experience. Uh, something new. Nice, awesome. And uh, just to kind of wrap things up here with one final question: uh, What is one goal that you hope to achieve within the next year here at uh, C3? I hope to become a fighter. That's that's why I started coming here. It's always been a dream of mine, so hopefully that will be that will come true soon. All right. Well, you guys heard it here. Miranda Granger, student of the month for the month of July.